Hello, this is going to be a video about which speed cubes are the best. Now partially the reason that I'm making this is because I want to show some of you guys what I think some really good speed cubes are. And I also want to ask any of you that have um, special cubes um, or particular cubes that you like, um, what do you think the best speed cube is like what what speed cube do you use because I kind of want to get a new speed cube I have really good ones but I kind of want a better one if there is a better one so I wanted to know if anyone has any ideas on what good uh, what a good cube is um, so anyway here are three good cubes that I would consider for speed cubing um, the first one which is the one I'm currently using for speed cubing is um, the newest um, Type A. It's the, or from Cube for You, by the way. It's the one that has those really annoying like tabs that stick out, and I didn't want to put those tabs in. It's also the one with the sliced off uh, corner piece, and it has the old um, yellow core. I've I've been using this one for a very long time. Um, this is really the first and only speed cube that I've ever bought. I have other cubes that work really nice as speed cubes, but really this is the only one that I actually um, speed solve with. It's pretty good. Um, I just feel like the plastic is a little um, is a little different. Some of the newer cubes that I'm coming out have a different plastic that works really nice. Um, but this one by far has the least amount of lockups, and that's why I use it because some of the other cubes are really nice smooth smooth wise but they lock up a lot speaking of which um, this is the new uh, cube for you um, speed cube um, it's the one with the new orange core and the pieces that all have caps on them like it's the one where you have to put the little caps in here and the caps on the corner pieces sorry I don't know if I got that in the camera um, now this cube, the plastic on it is really, really smooth. It reacts very well to silicone. But the only thing that I've noticed is, is that it locks up a lot more than this cube does. And I've messed with the tensions on both of these cubes, and I got them just about right. But for whatever reason, if I loosen this cube um, to make it smooth, it locks up a little bit more. And if I tighten it, it loses some of the smoothness. And so that is really the only reason why I'm still using my old Type A for speed cubing is because it has less lockups than the new cube for you speed cube. Um, just some other good cubes to mention. The glow in the dark cubes, for whatever reason that they have this um, specialized plastic that glows in the dark, for whatever reason it moves really smoothly. These glow in the dark cubes work really, really well. Um, let's see if I can get it back to the original. Okay, there we go. Um, these glow-in-the-dark cubes move really, really smoothly. And it's because of the weird glow-in-the-dark plastic, I guess. But um, if, if you want to get a glow-in-the-dark cube to use as a speed cube instead of a white cube, it would be a very good idea. If, if you like white cubes, um, this one's almost white. So, I mean consider getting this one instead of the white one because for whatever reason the glow-in-the-dark plastic works really well with silicone also uh, a few cubes to mention that I don't have with me right now um, the transparent cubes are really really nice I have a blue transparent and I've seen other videos that say the clear transparent is very nice also so this is just a couple of um, my nicer cubes so again the old type A the new uh, cube for you speed cube and the glow in the dark cube but basically this is the reason why I made the videos because I want to know um, if you guys have an old like this type a puzzle and you have a new speed cube that's better than this one because I kinda wanna get a new speed cube but I don't know what to get because I already have the new cube for you cube and it doesn't really seem that much better seems a little better in certain ways but worse in others so I'm gonna stick with my old type A for now 
but I'm kind of looking for a new speed cube. So if you guys have any ideas on what some good speed cubes are, maybe if you're an experienced cuber that has um, higher scores, you know, like somewhere in the in the 20 second range, then I would really appreciate your help on getting a really nice speed cube. This one's good. And if there's not a better one out there right now, then I mean, I can deal with this one. This one's fine. It's just that if there is a nicer one out there and I don't know about it, I would really like to be informed so I can get one. So anyway, thanks for watching the video. This, hopefully this is a shorter video than what my normal videos are like. But anyway, there you go. Three good speed cubes. All right, see you guys. If you like this video and want to see more like it, please check out my channel or subscribe to my channel. I have many, many cubing videos, so I'm sure you'll find something that you like. Um, if you have a question, leave a comment or a message. I'll be glad to answer. And uh, thanks for watching. Please rate and subscribe.